Bach Institute is the best, the most well-known uh, private institute uh, focusing on research on aging. So what are the main areas that you think are uh, very, very important at the moment that you focus on? Yeah, so we focus on two broad areas. One is these lifestyle factors. Mm -hmm. We know what they are, and you know I mentioned them. Nutrition, exercise, stress, stress sleep, uh, social connection. What we don't know so well is how do I implement this in my life? And, you know, we, if you think about exercise, think about endurance, like running and bicycling versus walking versus uh, yoga, which is more stretching, mm -hmm. thinking about, um, you know, so there are or strength training when you start pushing weights. So there's all kinds of exercise that can be done. What we don't really know or understand is which ones actually work the best for your longevity. I, I argue that it's a little bit of all of them, including balancing and so on. So what we're studying is how does exercise work? Why does it make you so healthy? That's number one. The same thing for nutrition. Think about fasting. You know, we know fasting really promotes health. The question is how, why, how does it work? Um, same thing for sleep, same thing for all of these interventions. We're trying to understand the molecular mechanism. How do these interventions speak to the aging mechanism? Mm -hmm. What can we learn to optimize? For example, uh, you might tell me, I don't have 30 minutes to walk. Well, maybe I will find out that there's a seven minutes high in intensity interval training that actually does all of this. Yes. Then you cannot say, I don't have 10, I don't have 20 minutes. Well, just 10 minutes. Mm -hmm. um, so, Oh, so that's one big area that we're working on. The other area we're working on is um, for people who are unable to do this uh, or who are really at, at risk of accelerated aging, and there's a subset of people who are, you know, live much long, much less long, um, is to identify and discover drugs and or supplements that actually have the same effect. And so I can see, and we have those. So in the last 20 years, we've discovered uh, dials on the aging pathways that you can tweak. And when you tweak them, essentially you are, can slow down the rate of aging, which is remarkable. We've identified drugs that slow down aging in animal models. And now we've entering at the back and, and many other places in the world, including here, a new phase where we take all of this incredible knowledge about aging and we start introducing it to humans and, and really trying to change the way we think of medicine. You know, we think of medicine when you're sick. We want to think of medicine when you're healthy. How do you keep healthy your whole life?